Hinchliffe Stadium has been a community focal point for nearly 100 years. It was designed by Fanning and Shaw in the Art Deco style in the early 1930s. It's hosted professional football, boxing matches, concerts, you name it, it's happened there. The New York Black Yankees was the primary Negro League team of Hinchliffe Stadium. The Negro Leagues were an association of African-American baseball teams that were largely active from 1920 to the late 1940s. Those leagues were formed when black players were excluded from major league and minor league baseball due to segregation. Honoring that full history was what was important to the community. The stadium ceased operations in 1997 and sat vacant for approximately three decades. It was in really bad shape. There was a very dedicated friends group who brought attention to this decaying facility and that culminated in 2013 with this site's designation as a National Historic Landmark. The full scope of the project was the restoration of this 7,800 seat venue. Hinchliff Stadium has been returned to the community and it's a unique public-private partnership. The facility is operated and maintained by a joint venture of development partners. The facility is owned by Patterson Public Schools. They helped guide the restoration to the benefit of the local students. These kids can now play on a field that Hall of Famers played on. It's been really gratifying to see how the community is interacting with this resource, with this museum. I'm happy to have been a, a small part in what's really just a much greater story.